How's it going, everyone? There's a lot going on in the world right now. I'm not going to talk much about it. I just, I hope you're all safe. I feel like the only thing I can really do in situations like this is to uh, provide a little snippet of entertainment. Hopefully it's entertaining uh, for you guys uh, during times like these. So let's play some Geometry Dash. Today I'm going to be playing another Nine Circles Insane Demon. I'm going to cross another one off the list by playing this one called Power by Toxic which is really fun. I, I really enjoy this level, actually. And when it first came out, apparently a lot of people didn't like it. So the ID is 36831819, which came out maybe uh, a year after 2.1 came out. So somewhere around there. Uh, but anyways, it's a pretty cool looking nine circles level. And I really enjoy the gameplay. So yeah, there were some bugs. A lot of people just were pretty negative about it. There were a lot of people that were pretty positive about it too. But apparently it got toxic to, to say this. Can you please stop judging me because of power? It's so old. I improved my style a lot. Seriously, stop. And it's kind of weird. A lot of people like bringing that up because I actually really, I really like this level and I think it's pretty cool. Um, It also has a dedication to me at the end, which is awesome to see as well. I know like over the years, there's a lot of levels that have been dedicated to me and rated, which I haven't played. And uh, I'm glad it was this one because it got some negativity but I really enjoy it. I think it's a really good nine circles levels. I think it just got negativity because it was at that time where nine circles hate was at its peak. There was a time in the game where anything nine circles that got rated, people were like, oh, enough with this trend already. Um, but now these days it's gotten kind of a resurgence again and people have enjoyed it because it's just kind of a style of level that focuses on the wave and some flashy effects, which there's nothing wrong with that. I love nine circles levels. They're great. Um, so Toxic's probably not watching this, but if you are, man, I, I really enjoy this level. It's probably gonna take me a while, though. This is an insane demon. This is the only level we're gonna do today. Let's just let's just brush up these skills in practice mode. Now, I do find the wave part I'm decently consistent on, um, but there are some parts at the beginning that are tricky. But it, it's gonna it's gonna get really consistent at the beginning, hands down. Like it's it's already pretty consistent. A lot of people learn this level so fast. Like there are some people that I see in the comments that are like, oh man, is this a medium demon? I'm like, what? Like, no, it's an insane. Might be an easier insane, but it's still like an insane, you know? I got to remember that. Like, it's... Dude, actually, you know what? I, I wasn't that good at this level. I just had a... That was a pretty decent attempt at the beginning there. Like, I this level flows, man. It's a little learning at parts, but holy crap. Like, it, it flows really well. It goes well with the song, too. And does that look good, man? Man, I, li I like the way that looks. It's, it's very vibrant and very, very cool looking. One thing I love about it too is there's no parts that are way harder than the others. It just has this nice, consistent kind of easier insane demon difficulty. Man, I'm like, I'm all here for it, dudes. I, I think it's, I think it's pretty good. Yeah, I got, I got to double click that button. And then for, I have all the space in the world at that part. And that's a problem for me is I never line myself up. I'm like, gee, la, 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 la. Okay, there we go. There we go. I'm getting it. And then you can't go down there. It looks like you can slide, but you can, you can't slide. You can't. No, the game it doesn't want it doesn't want you to slide on the bottom. Dude, I love these portals right here, because like it goes it goes to the song. It's like da da da. Like as you're straightening yourself out with the ship, and it's totally intentional and it's totally good, man. I don't know. Like as a person that's played a lot of Nine Circles levels, and I've played I've played a lot of I played a lot of bad ones, you know. Like, this level is good. It's a good circles level. I don't... Man, I, I don't get how anyone could hate it. Like, maybe if nine circles things isn't your cup of tea, I get you'd be like, oh, I don't really like it because I don't like nine circles levels. But to just, like, to not like this level, even if you're into nine circles levels, I don't I don't understand that at all. Like, I, I think the ending wave part is... It's definitely easier than the first, like, 20% of the wave. And then, dude, this memorization part at the end is gonna kill me. And I might actually cry. You might actually finally see me cry. Because there's a lot to there's a lot to do. There's a lot to remember. What am I doing? It's it's pure memorization. There's no kind of like hints at what you gotta do. You you just gotta remember. And I'm gonna oh man, I'm gonna die here and I'm gonna be so sad. Dude, what? There's definitely like a lot of timings as well here. Yeah, this this ending part is it's a it's a dude, it's a little cruel, man. It's a little cruel because it, it feels a little awkward. It's not just memorization. It's definitely like timings and some little bit of awkwardness as well. Wow. Like, wow. Dun, dun, dun. And then you, get, you just double tap that. But you can hit what? You can hit that too early. You got to double tap that so fast. And you can still like mess that up. My God. Dude, I'm going to die to the end like three times. Oh, no. Sadness awaits me there. It's going to be so brutal. Oh, okay. 
It's weird. Uh, yeah, so this level, I guess, was at the height of like nine circles toxicity. And by toxicity, I mean like the community's overall negative impression of nine circles levels because at that point they'd been overdone a lot. And so this level did not get rated for like a feature, even though like there's good like new nine circles levels that get rated for a feature, right? So dun, dun, dun. nice. OK, let's just let's get consistent getting to the wave. Let's just get. Yeah, we'll get consistent getting to the wave. And then we'll be all bum, bum. then we'll be all good. Nice. Oh, those timings, bro. Dun, dun, dun. It's so easy to hit that too early too, man. There's a lot of little bits you got to remember, you know? There we go. Got to the wave. Hell yeah. Okay. Wipe the sweat off the hands from all that sweaty practice. Yeah. <laughs> so this level, a lot of people that do a lot of nine circles levels do consider this a uh, fairly easy, you know? They're like, oh, this level took me like 300 attempts. And this level, I think I've put in like 700 attempts learning it. So... I think I haven't really been challenging myself in GD much lately. I took a bit of a break after the 12 Demons of Christmas when it comes to like hard stuff. And I think I'm getting rusty. Bum, 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 bum. Second attempt at the wave. Dude, the buildup is so long. Okay, here we go. Come on. Dude, I died in there? What? Yeah, the, the, the beginning part's not that bad aside from the first cube. The first cubes, it's just a little bit awkward. If it just feels really weird going through here. It's the only part of the level I'm not a big fan of, really. The rest of the level I really like. Like, the rest of the beginning as well. Like, I like the... F Holy shoot! What? I like the flying part, and, uh... I like the ball and the robot, but... These Q parts is... This is... This is kind of annoying. Whoa, dude. Dude, what an attempt, man. I can't believe I held it down too long. What? No, I think I went up a little too early there. And so I overcompensated by holding it down too long. Dude, there was a part in that run where my hand went kind of shaky and I like double tapped really quick and it almost messed me up. But it was kind of in an open area. Whoa, that was that was weird, man. Dude, I'm getting like, are my hands getting too shaky for this game? Like, I, you know what? You know what it is, actually. I will openly admit um, I play a lot of Destiny 2. Okay. And, uh... You know, I haven't been playing as much just because, you know, I have a kid now. But it's it's like my go-to MMO game when I do have time. And the new expansion dropped yesterday. And uh, me and my friends, we went through the whole thing. <laughs> my hands, I think, are just shaky from all that gaming. Talking about people hating on a trend, like, people used to really hate the Nine Circles trend. And to be fair, like, at the end of 1.9, it was being way overdone. Um, but that the thing is, is there wasn't much creativity at that time with it. Like... The ni when nine circles, when the nine circles trend was at its peak in 1.9, it was literally people just using the exact same effect, but changing the color, you know, like I get why the nine circles hate kind of started. Like, don't rate these levels that are just effects are just basically copied from one level to the next. Right. Like, I get that. But a level like this that looks good and like plays really well, mostly well. Like, I, I actually I just I don't get that, man. I don't get why you just blindly hate something. Because it is, it's because it's part of the trend, but it's like, but it's still like good, you know? Like imagine people hating like travel levels, you know? Oh, I hate travel levels. Like what? There's like, there's a lot of like really great travel levels, you know? Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, come on. Why didn't I get up there? I'm so rusty, man. That's not that hard. I'm just, dude, I'm rusty. I got to play more Geometry Dash. I've been really slacking off, guys. I apologize. Although I have been taking a much-deserved break. I haven't really taken a break in many years, so it's actually been kind of nice. And hasn't even really been a full break because I've still been making, like, other videos, right? Dude, I get, are you serious? I went down too far there. Ah, that's so, it's such a painful death. There's so much space there. I, what did I did, did there's it's not all open on the bottom. It's just like ah. Oh, it's what? Why can't I get in there? Dude, I, <laughs> you can miss 
the normal portal if you slide on the bottom. Dude, what? I was like, you can see the end of the level right there between those spikes. How did I, there's no way I hit that. Like that must've been just the tiniest little pixel. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. I am... That's a good level, man, but I am so rusty. I am so rusty. Like, that took me way longer than it should have. Man, if I would have done that right after the 12 Demons of Christmas this year, like, in my prime, would have been playing the game a lot. Holy crap, I would have crushed it. This took me way longer than expected. Uh, great level. I like it. It flows really well, and I gotta say, like, I was... I was dying to a lot of different parts in the level. I wasn't dying to the same part all the time. There were so many different places I was dying to. So I do feel like the difficulty is fairly well balanced throughout the whole thing. And uh, it's good. It's just a solid, insane demon. And it, it it's really easy to underestimate this level, though. I underestimated it so much. Oh my god, like it looks, when you practice it the first time, you're like, okay, like I'm dying a lot, but it looks pretty open, you know? I'm not going to... It's not gonna take me that long once I get it right. But I, maybe it's because I'm rusty. Maybe it's because the level's actually harder than it looks, but I felt like it was pretty hard, man. I had a very difficult time. That was over a thousand attempts, 1,376, and it is an insane demon. I get it. It is an insane demon. But when I first started practicing this level, I thought this is an easy insane demon. It's definitely gonna be under a thousand attempts, like 500, 800 maybe. 1,376, I spent a long time on this, man. Whoa. But hey. That's another one off the list. If you check the spreadsheet down below, you will see what levels I have remaining to do out of all the rated nine circles levels in the game. I haven't updated it in a while, so there's probably others that are on there, and I'm not going to update it until I make a little bit more progress because I want to actually, like, check off a bunch of them before I start adding more <laughs> so I can feel good about myself. Thank you so much for the dedication, Toxic. This is... So many years later, I don't think you're going to be watching this, but thank you so much for the dedication. I'm glad uh, a really solid Nine Circles level was dedicated to me like that. Um, very, very cool, man. Some people would argue, hard demon, but not really. It's like, it's an insane, man. It's an insane. It looks like it would be a hard demon. You see someone complete it. I bet like as you're watching me do it, you're like, oh yeah, that looks like a hard demon for sure. But it's not. It's deceivingly hard. There are some wee awkward click patterns, and it looks like they're not, though. And when I practiced it, it didn't seem like it was either. But there are. There's awkward click patterns. It's tough. It's tough. Definitely think uh, my vote goes for definitely an insane demon. See, a lot of people aren't a fan, man. They're like, worst NC level. Not a fan of the gameplay, but the deck was really nice. Man, like, man, no way. That was certainly level. I don't get the negativity for this. Like, it was tricky, but that it's it's an insane demon, you know? Like, yeah, it's supposed to be tricky. This isn't a free circles level. It's hard. Dude, this level gets so much negativity. It's so weird. I do not understand the negativity for this level. I don't get it. Because I have played so many nine circles levels up to this point, And 
There's only a handful of them that I really didn't like, but this one is way better than any of those. And it's actually like, I would call this good. I wouldn't even call it mediocre. I, I'd call this good. I've played a lot of mediocre nine circles levels, tons of mediocre ones. As a matter of fact, most of them are mediocre. I would say this one's good and there's quite a few good ones. And then like really good ones, there's only like a few really good ones, right? And there's a handful of ones that are absolutely terrible, but this one is not that, you know? So I don't, I don't understand the hate for this level at all. Overall, it was pretty fun. I was a little bit rusty. It took me longer than expected, but still pretty good, you know? Like even the, the parts of the beginning of the level, there's some hard parts and the ending part, the memorization part, there's some timings for sure. But at no point did I think they were way harder or unbalanced, you know? Like there are some hard wave patterns that match the difficulty of the beginning and the end of the level. I think it's fairly balanced. I don't get the negativity for this level at all. Anyways, what's your opinion of it? I'd like to know. Hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like, helps me out a lot. And I will see you in the next one. As always, peace.